Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll guide you through the process of disconnecting unknown devices from your Wi-Fi network. Let's get started. First, open your preferred web browser, such as Google Chrome. In the address bar, type the IP address of your Wi-Fi router. This IP address is usually provided by your internet service provider and is often written on the back or bottom of your Wi-Fi router. Common examples are 192, something. Press Enter to load the login page for your router settings. Once the page loads, you will be prompted to log in. Use the username and password for your router. If you haven't changed these credentials, the default login information might also be on your router. If you can't find it, check your user manual or contact your service provider for assistance. After logging in, look for a section labelled Connected Devices, Device List, or something similar. This section lists all devices currently connected to your Wi-Fi network. Take a moment to identify the devices listed. You might see device names, MAC addresses, or IP addresses. Find the device you want to remove. If you're unsure whether a device is authorized, cross-check the names or MAC addresses with the devices you own. Unknown devices may appear with generic names or simply as unknown, so it's important to verify. When you identify an unknown device, select it. Most router interfaces will have a Block or Deny button next to the device. Click on this button to disconnect it from your Wi-Fi network. This action will immediately stop the device from accessing your internet. If your router offers a blacklist or blocklist feature, the device you just removed will be added there. This means it won't be able to reconnect unless you manually remove it from the blacklist. To do this, navigate to the blacklist section, locate the device, and click the Remove or Unblock button. This will allow the device to reconnect if needed. While you're in the router's settings, consider enabling additional security features such as MAC address filtering. With this feature, only devices with specific MAC addresses that you approve can connect to your network. This adds an extra layer of protection to your Wi-Fi. After making these changes, it's a good idea to update your Wi-Fi password. This ensures that unauthorized users can't reconnect even if they had access before. To update your password, go to the Wi-Fi settings or wireless settings section in your router interface. Look for the field where your current Wi-Fi password is displayed and replace it with a new, strong password. Make sure your password is at least 12 characters long and includes a mix of letters, numbers and symbols. Save the changes and reconnect your devices using the new password. That's it. You've successfully disconnected unknown devices from your Wi-Fi and secured your network. 